Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Knight. I'm gonna get straight into the video. I'm showing y'all some cheesy tattoos. So here's the first one. Um I don't know that that shit is fire to me, alright? Here's the second one. Here it look here's how it looks from the back. And um and then here's how it looks from the front, alright? So yeah, I'm gonna get straight into it and I'm gonna tell you how to get it for free too. Real quick though guys, if you guys could just hit that like button if you haven't already turn on post notifications and just leave a comment about anything y'all that's it all right so if y'all ain't know you, as you can see i got um, a free tattoo from the the spin the wheel if you didn't know if you get that it's not just one tattoo you get for free so basically i'm gonna show you all the skull tattoo right now right um what you do is you get a bunch of skulls right so 50 skulls which is 750 each they're all going to be free. So instead of spending, let's see how much. Let me whip out my calculator on my phone. Hold on. 750 times 50 tattoos. 37,500 VC. It'll all be free. So hold on, let me show y'all. So you enter the the tattoo shop. Don't mind me right now. I record this like in the morning. Um, I'm going to try to find out where the skull tattoos are. That's what you got to use, the skull. Which is right there. Uh, Day of the Dead. And as you can see, it says 0 VC. And I'm just getting 50 of them. So yeah, instead of paying the 37 bands, because I'm too cheap, I don't got VC for that, I'm saving VC. So you, um, yeah, get 50 of them, and you're going to see how I place them up. This is for the all black one. I'm going to show you how it looks on my player, because um, everyone does it differently. Um, as you can see, my player looks just like little TJ. If you haven't watched that video, make sure you check out that video. Your player will look just like little TJ with the face scan. So yeah, when you're trying to do this tattoo, you just want to go ahead grab a tattoo i don't know what my i don't know what i'm doing right here um let's <laughs> see what i do but yeah, you just keep overlapping them all right so you could do like a all black you could go for the all black look um let me hold on let me speed this up a little bit see i'm gonna just speed this up a lot i don't know i was just on some bullshit but yeah, as you can see i start putting the tattoo on the arm that's all you're gonna want to do and like i said with how everyone does it differently you could do it to where you make your player all black or, um, let me start speeding up again, actually. You could, like, create this kind of pattern. It's like a, a venom kind of, like, spider webby kind of pattern. In my opinion, I feel like that's better. But you gotta really mess around with it. Like, make, like, let's see if you're doing it on your arms, make it all black. No, on the arms, you should have the venoms, actually. So, I'm not gonna lie. I got kind of lazy while I was doing it because it was 2v2 rush going on. And I wanted to get some rep. But, um, as you can see, I'm just overlapping them. So, I'm gonna go ahead and speed it up again a little bit just to give you an idea of what I mean by, like, the pattern. But yeah, if you guys go to the stage, you'll see like a lot of people use this tattoo. So as you can see, at the very top, like how most of it's all black, but at the very top of the shoulder, like where the, the very top of the arm, it's like there's lots of gaps where it's not all black and it has like a spidery web kind of pattern to it. So I really encourage you guys to just like be creative as possible and just um just do it how you like it, you know? And the same goes for my Batman. This pasta giving me hiccups. Same goes for like the chest and the legs. Not too many people really keep up with the legs, so you could do whatever on the legs. But when you're doing the chest, same same concept. You just keep overlapping it. <clears throat> um, so I'm gonna get I'm gonna go ahead and show you. Um, I'm gonna speed it up a little bit, show you how I finished it off, and then get on to the other tattoo. But, um, yeah, as you can see, I'm finishing up right here. Um, I didn't really do that Venomy thing I was talking about, so, um, I was in a rush for this, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. I, I wanted to play the Rush 2v2. But, um, yeah. Oh, <clears throat> shit. <laughs> so, um, yeah, you do, um, you could do an all black, you know, just cover up your whole body. I recommend having, like, that webby, Venomy kind of, you know, pattern. 
But yeah, this is what the all black, you know, with the skulls look like. And it's pretty fire, I ain't gonna lie. It looks better in, like, if you really try. But yeah, so I'm gonna show y'all that it was free. And then I'm gonna show y'all the next tattoo. As you see, the cost was zero VC. Now I'm gonna show y'all the other tattoo. <laughs> All right, next, for this other tattoo, you're going to want to find the dragon sleeve, all right? Um, it should be somewhere around here. This was actually, I was in the share factory with my man's uh, Zero, and he did it for me, so shout out to him. Um, so, yeah, so I just did it right over my uh, black tattoos because, you know, I don't got VC to spend on that. It's way too much. So there it is right there, the dragon sleeve. And same thing like the skull tattoo, you just keep overlapping them, all right? Um, so I'm gonna show y'all how exactly he was doing it. All right, so give me a second. All right. Um. So yeah, he's gonna start it off with um on the arm. And um, I'm not gonna. I don't know which one I like more. I feel like if I put more effort in my one, that's how it is right now. The, the back looks fire the way I did it. The pattern, and as you see, there goes the pattern I did on the arm at the top. That webby pattern. I just didn't finish it with the skull tattoos. Um, I'll probably finish it later just to see how it looks. I don't know. Like they're both really cool to me. So. Just like the black skulls, you just overlap these, and um, like I just can't describe it better than that. You just keep overlapping them to your liking. Uh, when you get to the chest part, though, like right now on the arms and legs, you could do whatever. Um, but when you get to the actual um, chest, that's when you, you you have to do like perfect, or you, like you can still do it the way you want to do it. But like if you want it to look like this, hold on. If you want it to look just like that, you're gonna, you're gonna want to put in a lot of effort into it. Me, I'm lazy, y'all. Y'all know I'm lazy. I was just doing whatever. Actually, no, right here, I'll let my, my man Zero do it. But, um, yeah, it's just all about overlapping it. I'll go ahead and play out the video, but, yeah, I definitely recommend for this one, or for both of them, really, to take time on it. But just be creative. Um, Just do it how you prefer doing it. And, uh, yeah, man. Um, again, another thing, the face scan I'm using here, it's not the TJ one, it's a different one. I got a video on that. If you guys can, leave a like on that one for me too. A lot of people, like, if you have this face scan, a lot of people will send you squad invites. But yeah, man, um, just um, share this video with your friends, enjoy, and uh, yeah, man, it's your boy Knight. I'm out.